What's going on everyone? It's time for another family comedy film review. Today we're going to talk about a film called North. It was released by Columbia Pictures uh, July 22nd, 1994 and it was written by Adam Zwibble and produced, written and produced by Andrew Sherman. It was produced and directed by Rob Reiner who did films like This Is Spinal Tap, The Princess Bride, Stand By Me, and When Harry Met Sally. This had a box office of $12 million. So North. North is a, a young kid who really does not not like his parents and he gets into a load of mess where he meets uh he, where he meets up with one of his buddies from school who runs the local paper who knows a lawyer who could get him out of it and get him disown from his parents and stuff so he could find new ones so he goes on this wild adventure either well first they go to the court and they get he gets uh like a couple of weeks to go look for new parents so he goes on this wild adventure trying to find new parents he goes to texas he goes to antarctica he goes all over to hawaii he goes all over the world trying to find these um parents and it's a heartwarming comedy where he goes and he finds the he realizes the true meaning of family and stuff here. Also, there is a wise man played by Bruce Willis who's dressed up like the Easter Bunny and uh, tries to help guide him in that direction, which is actually pretty amusing because I didn't expect to see Bruce Willis dress up as an Easter Bunny and stuff. <laughs> yeah, there's a lot of good cameos in this film from a lot of stars and stuff, but in the end, this is a really raunchy family comedy. It's very unique and odd, and sometimes it works, sometimes comedy does comedy doesn't and uh, it really goes both ways it's definitely not a film that will be made this time around these these days because well yeah you have kathy bates playing a brown person and stuff in it like that's gonna fly these days it should but you never know and uh so yeah uh there's a Besides the stereotypes and stuff like that, I thought some of the characters were pretty dull and stuff. And uh, the story itself was amusing in that, but some of the jokes didn't work and stuff. So it kind of has its flaws there and stuff. But it's still humbling and entertaining at the same time. The cinematography is all right. So there are some scenes where it looks more like soap opera-ish. But for the most part, it still looks pretty good. The music's not too bad in it as well. And overall, I just thought the film was a pretty entertaining one, even though there is some dull characters and some pointless scenes in it and stuff. But for what it is, it's still an amusing film. So I'm going to give North a two and a half out of five. It's a decent, somewhat popcorn, lost popcorn flick of the 90s. So you should definitely check it out if you, if you can find it. I'm not sure where it's streaming or anything. I found this in the DVD collection I had. So um, yeah, I checked it out and sure enough, it was better than I was expecting. So yeah. But uh, make sure, so I'll link the trailer down below so you can check it out down there. Also, make sure you check out my Instagram, it's linked down below. So I post clips of films I'm going to review in the future. All my stories, you put the film title in there and some fun fact thing in there as well. Also, my letterbox down below, JP reviews. That's where I post my first star rating where I have to watch the films. And my Twitch down below, reviews underscore Eric. So well, follow me on those platforms, staying loop this channel. Like this video, share it some more people, whatever, comment your opinions of the film down below if you have any. If you have any films or film franchise in any genre and on any streaming service that you want to hear my opinions on, future comment those down below too. I'll try my best to get them as soon as I can, and if I can find them. Make sure you subscribe. Hope you find something weird, obscure, and odd that you probably never thought of checking out together. And also, so you hear my opinions on popular films that have come out, classic films, and reviews on other things as well. And don't forget to ring that bell because we're going to do another family comedy i think it's from the late 80s though called troop beverly hills in the next review so make sure you tune in for that and uh yeah we'll be doing other things after that so so tune in for that and yeah watch out for your kids trying to disown you and try to find new parents because well a lot of kids want to do that these days and i guess and it's about to happen again <laughs> in the not so distant future this is probably going to be legal to do so watch out for that and i guess i'll see you all in the next review so until then cheers <laughs>